the best bite of food I've ever had recently uh, has been the cocoa pod. <laughs> um, it's been something like, I don't know, 28 years since I had a fresh cocoa pod, which is what you make chocolate from. As soon as I tried it, it, was sort of take, it took me back to a little nine-year-old hiding in a, in a cocoa tree, <laughs> eating this as, as it was my candy. Um, so that has got to be you know, the best bite that I've had in a long time. Definitely the uh, chocolate dessert, the Louis XV chocolate dessert in Monaco. Definitely one of my greatest memory in two things because it tasted delicious. The second thing, it was our first trip together after we got married. So deep in my memory. The advice I would give to young people coming into hospitality, do the time, you know, minimum a year. Um, there's nothing that looks worse on, on a CV as, as someone that jumps from one place to another, you know, two months here, one month there, um, you know, there's no trust there. Uh, so get that and get into a kitchen where, you know, you can learn and, and enjoy what you do. Be patient, that's the most important, and love what you do. Because the people who are going to work with you, they will share and their knowledge and passion. And you can always grow in the industry with that. So just use these tools and be patient. Three things I can't live without um, have to be uh, lip balm <laughs> in my handbag, Nurofen, <laughs> uh, and water. Very easy. I don't know which order I should take them in, but I will say my daughter, my wife, and some cheese. If I say the cheese first, I'm in trouble. <laughs>